Hello everyone, my name is Butter Tongsley, and welcome back to another episode of Genshin Impact. Where we last left off, we have just met with the uh, Resistance, and we have also done a little bit of touring with them, with their allies, as well as their encampment, and we also got to meet Her Majesty, uh, the one who is leading all of them. And... I've already forgotten her name. Uh, I'll pop up the name right here. That's her name. Sorry about that. <clears throat> but she has put us in charge of becoming the, uh, I believe it was the captain of the Swordfish 2. And we, of course, got to prove ourselves. We have to prove ourselves so that they will listen to us and deem us worth listening to. So we... We're going to head back to the area, because I was going over this area off camera for a little bit of commission grinding, stuff like that. And we are going to continue on that quest, and we're going to earn their trust by getting rid of the, uh, of the enemies. And... Soon, there will be a new game that I will be doing another duo recording of with another one of my friends on my channel. And I hope you guys are looking forward to it. It is a, it, it's a rather uh, really awesome looking game. It's a third person shooter called The Forever Winter. I have actually did a test recording uh, which ended poorly. Because it was lagging to hell, but then I recently found out that uh, restarting the game after I lowered the settings uh, fixed it. I didn't notice a notification for that, but I should have probably thought of that in my head in the first place, so that's, that's my mistake. But we, uh, I got that working now, and I hope you guys are looking forward to that, because I'll be finally doing a duo recording with another one of my friends, and who knows, maybe we'll get some of our other friends to join us. Um, and make it from a duo to, uh, uh, let's play with friends. Till then, it's a duo, a duo with me and my friend, Cronin, which I look forward to doing. Uh, so I think we already talked to him, but it's making me talk to him ag again, so I guess... Ah, you must be the new captain of Swordfish. Yeah, this is the same stuff we already did, so I'm gonna skip this, because I already, I already I did this. I already talked with this guy, so I'll see you guys when I'm starting the... Objective. Okay, time to deal with that. Who makes a bridge with few panels missing? Bunch of dumb, dummy, dumb dums. Okay, I'm here to kick your asses, and now I'm angry. <laughs> Expect to be ass whooped because I'm angry. Thunderclap. That's right. Oh, oh, I see how it is. Have some drinks on the rocks. That's right. Oh, I. Okay. I messed up because I meant to swap to her whenever I use my Q for my travel character, but you know that's fine. I'm I'm literally kicking these guys' asses. No, you don't. That's right. That is right. Oh, was that supposed to hurt me? Well, too bad. All right, time to get rid of this. Get him, Barbara. Get him, Barbara. Get him. Okay, seems like you can hold your own. The rumors are exaggerations, of course, but still, your abilities are admirable. Yeah, I'm noticing rumors are a lot of exaggerations due to a certain person who we know of. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Kotoku, acting captain of Swordfish 2. This is Yoshihisa, a fellow veteran of the team. I now formally cede the position of captain to you. Swordfish 2 awaits your orders. 
Are there any other Ronin to deal with? There are two hard-hit areas. This was one of them, but thanks to you, this area is now secure. Their only remaining stronghold is located at the shallows on the east side of the island. I was feeling my nose there because I felt like I might have popped my nose. I'm fine. I'm fine now. I was just f having a weird feeling like right in this area of my nose, I thought I popped it. Like, just went, but I didn't hear the part. That said, the ones over there are tougher, and there's more of them. We should take a look. You got that right. Watatsumi Island is busy fighting the Shogun's army on the front line. We can't let these guys mess up things at the rear. Exactly. When there's cockroaches to be smushed, well, don't smush them because that doesn't kill them. It's better off just using bug killer and other stuff. But still, we're going to take care of them right now after I figure out what this is for. Yeah. Please don't fuck up. Oh, I it almost did it again. Hey, no, don't, don't climb the little bush tree. Alright, I did that. Now, oh, I see it. There's another one over there. This area of Inazuma, I will say, is starting to become my favorite just because I like the... I like how there's, like, floating, flying jellyfish. I honestly didn't expect to see a world with, uh, flying jellyfish. Okay, I decided to say screw that puzzle because my cooldown for my ability is not fast enough to really do that puzzle. And I'd rather just continue with the story and not get distracted. Especially since I'm making such great progress. Oh, wait, I wanted to capture one of those. Those look cute. Oh, oh, wait, are we actually looking at them now? That's not even all of them. They oh. have two more camps nearby. I was hoping that we were get a close up of those weird little red worm things that were poking out. They looked adorable. They remind me of those uh, things from Monster Hunter World. The things that pop out of the ground and you can get get one as a pet if you use the capture net. I wanted to grab one. Whichever camp we attack, it's the Ronin in the other two camps that'll cause us issues. They might decide to provide backup or abandon them and escape on their own. Then let's attack them all at once! But Captain... That would put you in great danger. Eh, I fought worse dangers than Ronin. If we spread our troops too thin, we won't have enough men to guard you. It's too risky. I'm fine. Yep, the traveler eats amateurs like these for breakfast. All right then. We'll deal with them all in one go and rendezvous with you on completion. Can I take a look at those little things first though? Oh no, they're gone! Oh come on, I wanted to see them. I wanted to see what they look like. Maybe even snap a picture. Ah. Game ruined it for me. Burn! That's right. Get your booties beat. Get your booties beat. Get your booty beat! Oh, hi! Okay, these are the ones I really don't like. Oh, I am so glad I had that. Ah, you think you can block me? No, you're not. I'm ready. Ow, okay. You were ready. That's fine. That's fine. This is fine. Everything's fine. Everything's a-okay. Whoa. Aha! Uh -huh. That's right! Take this! 
Fine. Cool. Hmm. Paimon wonders how everything is going with Kotoku and Yoshihisa. Should we go over and check on them? We probably should. Captain. <laughs> Captain, the other two camps have been cleared. The entire rear guard of Watatsumi Island is now secure. Nice. Great. <sighs> we solved the Ronin problem and got everyone to look up to us, too. Um. But what's next? Let's go back and check with Kokumi. Finally, we got it done. These Ronin have been bugging me for ages, but Kotoku wouldn't let us at them until now. What? No way could you have taken them down without the new captain here. I was putting the safety of the team first. Got it? <laughs> oh, come on. You were just being a coward. I think they're just being good friends. Hey, cut the attitude! <laughs> or not. These Guys, honestly, forget them. Let's go. Yeah, let them have their little argument. Sometimes you can tell how good friends are when sometimes they argue with each other enough. Let's go back and tell the lady the good news. Oh, Kokomi. Okay, so she's Kokomi. Alright, I'll try to remember that in the future. How was it? Did your initiation go smoothly? Without a hitch. <laughs> I'm sure you're playing it down a little. Kotoku and the others put you through your paces, I presume. Oh, yeah, a little. It was just Ronin. Wasn't that bad. But with your level of ability, I'm sure it was a walk in the park. I did pretty good. I will say that. Since you're back, I take it that the Ronin are now gone from Watatsumi Island? Oh, yeah. You bet. We sure showed them who's boss. Good. Now we just need to make sure Okubo keeps a close watch to prevent their resurgence. Thank you. I believe in rewarding merit, so you will be compensated for your hard work. Um, let me see. Hmm. Too soon for another promotion, I think. I think um, I could increase your pay. I am kind of scrounging on Mora. I would be fine with just a little extra Mora. I do not mind. And I need to take care of that. I'll make sure to take care of that. Wait for it to go away. Okay. I gave him an assignment. He's taking part in a surprise attack against the Shogun's Navy. He expressed a desire to be on the front line. So I honored his wishes. Now, speaking of assignments, I have a special mission I'd like to give you. A special mission? Okay, they're asking again. I really gotta take care of that. Yes. In between Watatsumi Island and Tarasuna, there are some ruins relating to a god who fell in the Archon War. There are several small islands there. Often used as a transit point when transporting supplies. Recently, however, supplies stored there have started to go missing for no obvious reason. Stranger still, the Resistance Army passed by and reported they found no signs of danger. I'd like to task you with getting to the bottom of this. It's not urgent, so there is no need to leave immediately. I suggest you take a few days to familiarize yourselves with the Army and also with Watatsumi Island. When Tepe returns, you can catch up with him. Then pick a day when the weather's good to set sail for the islands. Sure thing. Is Tepe really gonna be okay? He has a tendency to dive into action without thinking things through. Oh, Paimon can't help but feel a little worried about him. Oh, why don't we go wait for him at the training grounds? Alrighty, we'll go wait for him at the training grounds, and it'll give me time to... Okay, never mind. I was hoping to take care of the Long invite thing. No see. So, how's Swordfish 2 treating you? Getting along okay with everyone? 
Well enough. <laughs> well, you're in luck, because this seasoned veteran's got a few leadership tips for you. Raising their pay will boost morale, while giving them a few bounties will act as an incentive to go the extra mile. It's also important to maintain strict discipline at all times, and finally... Uh, wait. What was it? What was it? Wow. Where'd you learn all that, Tepe? I read it in a novel from the Yai Publishing House. It was a long time ago. <laughs> you wouldn't believe how many dongo it took to convince my friend to let me borrow it. You're seriously gonna use a novel to tell people how to run an army? Pretty sure that's called being an armchair general. Ha <laughs> ha! That's where you underestimate me. That's right. I'm learning military management on the job now. Just like you. Wait, you mean... You'd better believe it. Thanks to my outstanding achievements in the recent naval battle, I have officially been made the captain of my very own special operations unit. It's a brand new unit. Herring 1. What do you think? Pretty awesome, right? So all of the units are being named after fish. Because their leader is a girl who apparently likes to hang around with sea creatures like jellyfish and no doubt other sea creatures. Okay, I see where this is going. I spoke to Her Excellency and she says our uniforms are in production. Let's go collect them together once they're ready. Oh, I can't wait to put them on. We're really going to look the part. Ah! <laughs> Everything's going great. Our mystery sponsor supplies have really helped turn things around. Will Paimon get a uniform too? Will I actually get to see it as a uniform? Or will I actually get it like a cosmetic thing? Of course. You're a recognized member of the Watatsumi Island Resistance. I'm actually curious if I actually get this as a cosmetic. Captain, a new assignment has come in. Hmm? Thank you, soldier. I'll be there on the double. All right, I better go. <laughs> See you again soon. You better watch out, partner. At the rate I'm going, I'll overtake you if you're not careful. Ha! In your dreams, mister! <laughs> I wouldn't be so confident if I were you. I'm at the top of my game right now. This is my time to shine. Go get him, Tiger. I'm so surprised that Pepe's been made a platoon captain. He must have been working super hard. Yeah, we all gotta work hard in life. Let's take a break, then go check out these Archon War Ruins. I would really like to be able to control myself now, thank you. Okay, I need to take care of a, a little bit of a thing. There we go. That way no one has to worry about the constant pop-ups. Because I'd rather people not get bugged by that. There we go. I got some Primo Gems and other warts to collect. How many Primo Gems do I have? Do I have enough for a wish? Ugh, not even close. Sooner or later, I'll get there. I'm making some nice progress though in all the gacha games I'm playing. Oh, hold on, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's actually been actually a few days here and there before I had a, a sneeze that powerful. Hopefully that. Hopefully that doesn't make me regret it. <laughs> Later on, for my neck. Urgent orders. I don't know who that character is. I think they're actually a character in here. I'll have to take a look at that. Hey, um, that answers my question about Mora. And let me check. Like, is that an actual character character yet? Oh, I saw... I saw trailers that was showcasing this character... I like Kino. Really cool, actually.
Okay, so it doesn't look like that character I saw in that, uh, notice is actually here. They might become a thing, though, sooner or later. I have an itch on my back. Hold on. We got an itch. Here we go. This should be the place. But something in Leo is right. Doesn't look like anything suspicious is going on. Could they be hiding? Let's see what we can find. Maybe it's related these to these. These electro monuments look a little suspicious. Okay, so it's related to this. Okay, I, I think I might have to temporarily switch a character. Because these things go out really quick. Unless they want me to use my ultimate? But I would have to charge up my ultimate in order to do that. So I'm just going to try and use a different character. Oh, crap. Whoa. Whoa, okay. Oh, lordy. All right, we got big guy here. Zap him, zap him, zap him. Whoa, zap him, zap him. Zap him. Oh, we're careful of those. Zap him, zap him, zap him. Bring him into pain. Hit him hard. Hit him hard, hit him fast, hit him hard, hit him fast. Whoop. Getting a little bit better at the dodging. Still a little bit shaky. Ah! Like right there, I couldn't dodge because I was in mid animation. That's okay because I got this, I got this, I got this. Whoop! Thunderclap! Zap him! Zap him! Zap him! Zap him! Zap him! Zap him! Whoa! Zap him! Zap him! Hit him! Whack him! Make him feel the pain! Okay, now quickly swap characters before I lose my chance. Glad that's over. Okay. As monsters go, that one was pretty tough. Um, but what's such a huge Thunderhelm Lodge girl doing here in the first place? Mm hmm. That doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Also, the atmosphere here? Because I'm on the creeps. Besides the constant rain and lightning storms? Anyway, the good thing is that it's over now. We should probably get going. Uh-huh. Pepe, what are you doing here? <coughs> wow, this is a surprise. I didn't know you were the ones investigating here. I just got back from delivering some supplies to the front line. I figured I'd stop by and clear any threats in this area on the way back. <coughs> Are you okay? Are you all right there, buddy? You're looking slightly the worse for wear. <laughs> Why does that keep happening to me? <laughs> I got struck by lightning again <laughs> in a cinematic. I'm fine. It's nothing. I must have caught a cold a couple of days ago while I was out at sea. <laughs> on my way past, I heard that someone had just arrived on the island to investigate, so I thought I'd come and take a look. Uh, if there'd been some real danger, I might have had the chance to be the hero. <laughs> Shame it was just you guys. Guess I came here for nothing. Pepe, don't you think there's something strange about this place? Hmm. Now that you mention it, there is something a little off about it. It could be that the Tatarigami is more palpable here, I guess. We're not that far away from Horobashi's remains. Horobashi? Who's that? A god. 
Look, there's the corpse over there. So is it a giant dragon or a giant fish? It looks like a dragon or a snake. Ah, it's a gigantic snake skeleton. Oh, it looks terrifying. Orobashi was the one who brought our ancestors from Menkanomiya to the surface. That's the origin of the Watatsumi Island you know today. Our ancestors regarded it as a guardian deity. But during the Archon War, Orobashi invaded Yashiori Island. The Raiden Shogun came out in person and slew Orobashi with the Muso no Hitotachi. That same slash also formed what later became known as Musojin Gorge. The Raiden Shogun created Musojin Gorge in one slash? Wow, that's pretty incredible! Yes, but the Archon War was brutal. <laughs> And Yashiori Island was completely destroyed during that battle. They say the Shogun lost something very dear to her along the way, too. Since Orobashi's death, there has always been <coughs> some animosity between Watatsumi Island and the Shogunate, but our different beliefs have nothing to do with why the Resistance was formed. We only rose up to fight against the Vision Hunt Decree. When Orobashi attacked civilization, the Shogun stood up and put a stop to it. But now that the Shogun is stripping people of their ambitions with the Vision Hunt Decree, it's time for someone to stand up and stop the Shogun. <coughs> Are you dying or something? Alright. I'm heading back. I was just dealing with some of the Shogun's elite samurai, so I think I'm gonna take a quick breather, and it's on to my next assignment. You should report back to Sangonomiya as soon as possible. Don't stay here longer than you need to. Being around the Tatarigami too long won't do your health any good. Is that what's happening to him? Is him being around the Tatarigami actually, like, killing him? Is it performing some form of weird illness to people around it? <coughs> <coughs> yeah, take care of yourself. Hey, don't worry about me. Peak condition. Sure. He sure made some big progress if he's already dealing with Shogun at Samurai. Paimon can hardly believe it. I don't know how long he's going to be able to do that, though, with his health sounding like that. I think the guy should stop pushing himself with all these jobs and lay down. Let's report back to Kokomi. Just want my characters at least and also end the video. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to take care of swapping my characters and we're going to end off this episode here. So in the next episode, we're going to talk to Kokomi and we're going to report to her of our well, findings and of uh, what's going on. And hopefully we also bring up something about like what's going on with uh, Tepe because I'm kind of worried for Tepe now. So, with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and ding the bell so that you guys can stay notified of the content that uploads onto the channel and to help support it. And as always, see you all in the next video. Take care and bye-bye, everyone.